Welcome, 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 welcome. Let's do my little Tavidians. Let's do my little Tavidians. My love. Okay, it's going to be the rest of December. The rest of December. So let's see what you guys. Let's see what you guys are up to. I just did Pisces. And um, I don't know why I'm talking about it during your read. I don't know if you're connected to a Pisces. We all have everything in our chart. Remember that always. Okay. But I just had an epiphany. And like, it's like, well, so my Pisces are going to have an epiphany. Um, and I kind of feel like you guys might have one because I felt the need to talk about it. So... I feel like it might be important for you guys to watch Pisces for some reason, okay? You have to honestly remember, we all have everything in our charts. So, I don't know what it's all about and why I felt the need to tell you that. But, whether you end up with this person or not, you're still going to have that epiphany. Okay? So, Taurus. <gasps> Taurus. Taurus energy, please. Last of December, of our love. And they just brought me right back. I don't want to be shuffling when I say it. They brought me back to Pisces. So some of you are dealing with Pisces. Or it's your own it's your own dang energy. Look and see where your planets are. Maybe you have a Pluto in Pisces. Maybe you have a Jupiter in Pisces. Because Jupiter's strong right now. See what I'm saying? So, so there's that. Or it could be somebody's Venus. All right. Dang. Six of air. Holy crap. I feel like almost all my zodiacs have gotten this. Moving forward, pushing through. It's the end of a difficult situation, which is awesome sauce. And it truly is. You got the world to back it up. All right. Some of you are taking a trip. But what they're saying is, congratulations, job well done. You know, this is joy, contentment. This is gratitude. This is your path of enlightenment about to be enriched. Oh, and you got the lovers. Dang. Dang. Okay. So... You got two sixes right here, too, with the lovers of the six, too. You have an intimate relationship with somebody, um, and if you don't, you will, because you're moving forward. You literally ended something to have a brand new beginning. So whatever this change is, you go, whoa, and the ten of earth, whoa, and the six of water. It could be what you passed, or it's a brand new soulmate. Holy shit. You guys might be linked to Pisces, or it's you yourself. Please understand that. We have every Zodiac in our chart. Some of you guys are amazing caregivers. I will tell you, if you lost... Somebody is raising their grandchildren, which is amazing. Thank you. They're thanking you. Okay. Um, but you also have guides. Like, meaning, like, if your ma passed away... This is for the feminine energy. Your ma, your grandmother. You got somebody there helping, talking to the children. Making them laugh. Making the situation a little easier. Because you've been through a rough, a rough patch for some, um, but you're about to have you're about to meet a soulmate. There's no question. Else, it's your past coming back. All right, but you wrapped up something. Something was over, you know, and you're about to to move forward. So whatever was stagnant, you're at the end of that difficult situation. That's amazing. Um, some of you might be traveling too with the world and taking a trip right here, like whoo wee, like. Yeah, taking a trip. Some of you are traveling by boat, by air. I, I don't know. You are, though. You are. For shorezies. For shorezies. And you had to have had some type of epiphany if something was over in order for you to start again. You knew you knew whatever you were holding on to was a no-good scenario, so you let it go. You had to have. Because that would be the five of air. You know, no one wins. I'm out. I'm out. You know? So... It's not worth harboring or nothing. So congratulations for, for making that decision to, to step into the light. Step into the light. All right, my little Tiridians. Dang, two of cups. Yeah, yep. All right, four of wands. This is a solid and a ten of cups. Holy shit, congratulations. I'm ending your reading there. <laughs> oh my god are you kidding me the next two weeks are going to be awesome sauce for you guys um for those who are in this energy 
for those who just fat setting up to, to start something new. If you just got out of a difficult situation, you're going towards your two of cups, your connection. This is, I mean, you got the two of cups, the four of wands and the 10 of cups. Like, hello, hello, the lovers, the two of cups, the six of cups, you, this is a life partner. This is a life partnership coming into, into to fruition. There's no question. I just saw a turtle, but it made me think of a frog. Um, this is amazing. This is this is more than just your thoughts. This is something coming into fruition. This is not a wrap-up. They all came out upright, too. This is not a wrap-up. This is not what you wrapped up. This is what's coming towards you. Tell me about this Two of Cups. And I haven't been doing it this way, but I'm gonna. All right. It's the five... It's the five of wands. I don't know if you feel like there's competition or if there's just arguments, you know, kind of fed up with this situation. So to me, this speaks of the past. All right. Because what, whoever this connection you have with, it's, it's arguments of energy. Okay. But the connection's there. You definitely have, um, same sex here too, for sure. These, uh, tell me about the four of wands. I want both of these. <coughs> I almost just choked on my own spit. I don't know. You might be in for a surprise. Because I think you're going to gasp. It's one of those where you didn't expect it. And you might be drinking something, eating something. Because that's exactly what just happened to me. And you're like, what? You want to move in together? You want to buy a house? What? You know what's weird with this card? And I never noticed it. Ever. Look at how the this little, look at that, perfectly dented out. I never noticed that. None of my other cards are like that. As above, as below type thing, heaven and earth, okay? You're solid for life. The other day I did that and I was like, I, was, I felt so thug for life. This is what this is. You're solid. And I want this other card too. I don't know why. It's the nine of cups. So now you got two nines. You know, this is you're you're already a happy go lucky person. You this is your energy right now. So if this is your energy right now, this is definitely your spread. Okay, you bounce if you've already bounced back from this, you're good. If you haven't bounced back from this, you're about to. But I feel like this is already your energy. I kind of feel like you're already solid. You don't need this person to make you solid. I think about when you think about this person, I think you you think you're going to argue. I think you think it's like, oh, it's just it's straight up confliction. But it's sitting under the world, too. And the way I'm reading it, it's kind of bizarre. It's, it's the end of that. Tell me about this Ten of Cups. I mean, like, hello, Nine of Cups, Ten of Cups, Nine of Pence, Two of Cups, Four of Wands. Like, doesn't everybody want to be a Taurus? Well, surprise, you are. Okay? Battle's over. Six of Swords down. Now you got the Six of Swords twice. Another sign, another sign had this twice. If somebody knows if you can uh, comment, that would be appreciated for all the other ones that don't want to struggle. Um, so this fight to get to, to reach fulfillment is going to be no longer a fight. Look at that. Ace of Wands. Woo -wee. I don't like that spider. Let's just look at it. Like maybe a chalet. I don't know. But it, this is like, whoa, fights over. Brand new passion, charisma. Like, whoa, whoa. Wow. You got the king of earth. You got a solid, solid, solid situation at the bottom of the deck. But I already told you it was going to be solid. This is amazing. Congratulations. Congratulations. I, I really hope I fall into this category. No matter who it is. I just want that abundance all the way around. I'm ready. I'm ready. Took me a long time to get there. Though, I'll tell you that. All right, the Queen of Swords is fair, making a fan just decision when it comes to whatever this is. They're saying be very practical here. All right, but at the same time, they also want you to take on, you know, with the Queen of Cups and the High Priestess. You got that intuition. With this divine feminine energy, needs to make a practical decision when it comes to this connection. I don't know what that's all about, but, you know, use your intuition at the same time. If your hat says to follow it, follow it. But make sure you're not being naive, you know. It's okay to follow your hat, but you got to make sure you, you bring your mind with you, guys. Okay? It's, it's common sense. Let's not lose our common sense along the way. I don't think you're gonna, but I'm just saying. 
you know how to use that intuition. And you got the high priestess and the queen of cups. You got this. That wisdom, that intuition, that you got it. Okay. Um, so I don't really need to get into this. Whatever this bickering is, you guys will clearly figure it out. It's the end of whatever it is that was bad, though. You got something fantastic. If you had to let go of somebody, this is not necessarily a person coming back for you. For some, it sure is with the six of cups being under there, too. But regardless, it's it's like a match. It's a, it's a destined match. It, I mean, this person's going to give you your 10. You go from the two for the 10, it's, it's a partner. It's a light partner, okay? So whoever's about to step into your life, new or from the past, is about to be... You're gonna have that epiphany. You just are. The battle will be over. The swords are the swords are down. It's gonna be on you whether or not you want to step forward with this person once you guys have a conversation. It's clear as day. For others, for something that was once over and it not ended so good, and you left, you left when you guys split or whatever happened. You stopped talking. It was left in compensation. It was left unshut. Okay, but I feel like your energy right now is solid anyway. You move forward. You got the four ones and the two nines. I mean, whoa, no, this is the six of cups. I thought it was a nine. Holy shit. You got the six of cups twice. Now you got three sixes. That's a good thing, guys. Three sixes is all about like, ooh, like it's, it's spiritual. It's so spiritual. It's a beautiful, beautiful beginning. It's, it's amazing. With the ten of cups, like I'm just amazed. You go from the two to the ten. That's, that's divine. Wow. Wow. I really hope this comes into fruition for you guys. I, I truly, truly do. Like, I mean, it's peaked. Whatever the situation has been. Or, I mean, it's, it's peaked. Okay. Some of you are going to choke when somebody says, let's move in together. Like, you're going to choke on your spit. <laughs> I love you guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye.